Lindsay, and we're here, and we're gonna find Mama Joe. Yes. We're gonna see him, and he's gonna be here soon, and we're gonna find him. We're gonna ask him some questions. Mama Joe, Mama Joe, Mama Joe, Mama Joe, Mama Joe. <laughs> Hi. 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 What are your thoughts on virtual youth camp? Um. I'm gonna really miss my boys not being in the dorm this year, but uh, you know, I know it has to happen because of the COVID-19. But I'm looking forward to seeing what people come up with on the internet, you know. What are your, what is your most memorable moment from being in the dorm? Oh, uh, that has to be when, um, it was probably 2009, somewhere in there. Um, a group of boys were having a rap class and, and uh, the spirit moved on them while they were in there and they were starting to speak in tongues and laid out on the floor. And it carried all the way from 3.30 that afternoon all the way into the night service at 7.30. And actually they, they didn't even have a service that night because the spirit moved so much. I will never forget that. That wow. was such a awesome day. Wow. Well, since youth camp is virtual, are you planning any pranks this year? Ooh. You know, I told my boys that I would never prank them. But there are quite a few people I can think of that I sure would like to prank now. Also, it is a rumor that you and bro um, you are you and Billy Bob Washpot are related. Do you have any comments on that? Well, He's from Tennessee and I'm from Kentucky. They are neighbors. And I do have some, I do have an aunt that married an uncle and, and, an, and an aunt that married a cousin. So, you know, anything is possible. Last question, is it true that you caught COVID-19 from Billy Bob Washpot? That's ridiculous. I wouldn't get 10 foot close to that guy. Six foot is not a minimum. Ugh.